The rugby cranes are to take on some of Africa's best seven sides when the All Africa Rugby Sevens tournaments take center stage at the Chadon Rugby Grounds in two weeks' time. Uganda emerged champions in the 2018 tournament held in Kampala. The rugby cranes qualified to compete in the 2018 Commonwealth Games, which were held in the Gold Coast, Australia. Now, the national team tactician Tolbert Onyango believes his side has come of age to lift the trophy again on home turf. It's another opportunity for, for Uganda to host uh, World Cup qualifiers. We last uh, hosted it in 2017 uh, at Legends. And uh, Adrian scoring in the last minutes against uh, Zimbabwe, a, a very tough side, was, uh, was pretty exciting stuff. So uh, four years down the line, we've seen a couple of those players who are still in the team and, and new faces. Uh, coming onto the squad to just lift up the intensity um, uh, and, and we are looking forward to, to a great tournament. The rugby cranes have had a number of training camps in South Africa and the players believe they have all it takes to post good results in the tournament. Personally, this will be my biggest tournament. It means a lot to me and the team. And having it at home, it's an extra motivation to put in more hard work put in dedication and be prepared to win. This was more like a project. I know, of course, I must say I'm better than I was before in terms of fitness, in terms of, of game plan, in terms of all these things. So, um, I've been on the team for quite some time now. Um, and this year, I, I feel like the, the energy levels are a bit more high. Um, we, are, we, are, we are training harder. Um, the skills level have just gotten gotten up. Um, I came in as as one of the youngest players, but right now we are we are all we are all there. Everyone wants to work. Everyone wants to push, and we are very excited. The All Africa Sevens tournament not only provides continental bragging rights, but also presents an opportunity to qualify for the Commonwealth Sevens in Birmingham, England. Colin Zimwes, NTV Sport.